Oh god, that's very zoomed. Okay, no one in this world needs to see me up that close this morning. Hello guys, so it's what feels like day a million in quarantine and I was thinking I've not really done a casual spend the day with me. I've only done where Rachel controls my day and I did like the viral routine, but I've not done just a normal casual spend the day with me, so that's what we're gonna do today. You're basically gonna spend the day with me, that's the whole point of the video, but you're just gonna see what I get up to while we're in quarantine which honestly this feels so long at this point <laughs> today i need to go and do my shot i'm going to do my daily exercise i haven't been working out i don't know where everyone is getting this motivation to work out from because that actually sounds I'd rather not. The one thing I have been doing though is yoga. I'm so into yoga at the minute and I feel like it starts your morning off really, really well. I say morning, I've not been waking up till like 12. That's so bad, isn't it? So I started my day today at 12 p.m. <laughs> But I haven't been sleeping till like four, which, you know, that sleeping pattern is probably not the best for your mental health. What is that noise? That's so annoying. Anyway, my mum's working at the minute, which I'm really sad about. So my mum's obviously a key worker. She works for the government and she's in work today and I really miss her because we've been spending every single day together and we've been baking together. We've been doing all that. So she's has to go in work today and I really miss her. But she'll be home soon, so I'm going to do the first half of the day, just me and then mum will probably like pop in. But the first thing on the agenda is I really want to go to Marks and Spencers. I was going to do my yoga first, but I feel like everything goes in shops so quickly at the minute. So I want to go now and just get it out the way and then I can do yoga and stuff when I get back. I've actually posted my first natural picture on Instagram as well, which I was kind of nervous about. So if you want to... Go and give it a little like, then I would be very grateful. Um, I don't know why I had to tell you that, but yeah. Anyway, okay, I am ready to face the wilderness. I don't think I've actually left the house in about four days at this point, and it's probably too much information, but you know me, you know I like to give out too much information. I've not worn underwear in like a week. So. <laughs> that was actually perfect. Oh. Why does it keep zooming in? Got in my car and my car, my camera tripod was already in the car because I've just filmed, well the other day I filmed a playlist video. I don't know which video was going up first, this one or the playlist one. I think probably the playlist. So if you've not watched it, I'll leave it in the description box. But it was already in here so I can do a little drive with me on my way to Marks and Spencers. It is a little bit further out than like my Tesco and Morrison's but I just prefer the food from Marks and Spencers. I don't know why I'm doing this like I'm sponsored by Marks and Spencers but if you want to sponsor me then <laughs> okay I've got a list of things that I want to get because I've been eating really bad recently so I probably need to actually go um I've been eating really bad recently so I just wanted to get some really healthy bits some nice fruit just can't stop eating like gen no but seriously the glasses are off I can't stop eating because I feel like everyone's joking about it but I'm dead serious I mean, not everyone's joking, but I hope that I'm not the only one gaining weight because I'll be pretty pissed off if I see all my friends and they've not gained an inch because I'm definitely gaining inches. So, anyway. <laughs> Hopefully it all goes straight to my ass and not to my belly. But knowing my look, it'll probably go straight to my stomach and great. <laughs> I feel like YouTube needs to chill out on copywriting me because how sick would it be if we could just listen to music together now but obviously we can't do that oh my gosh i forgot marks and spencers do the bottles of porn star martinis i feel like that is gonna be a shout for later i've just got to marks and spencers and i've realized i've not got a pound for the trolley which i don't think i'm at that level of adult yet where i remember to bring a pound for a trolley basket it is i wanted to do a big shop really but i probably can't do that um but yeah i've just arrived at marks and spencers and i'm fully fully geared up for the trip i've got some hand sanitizer this one smells really good it's from top shop i feel like i've had it ages but it's melon so let's pop a little bit of that on i've also got some more in here as well honestly i'm obsessed with hand sanitizer at the minute i'm a bit nervous i've not left the house in a couple of days so i forgot what it's like to actually not that i'm going to be interacting with humans but you know i've got to speak to the cashier woman anyway 
let's go. It's actually my lucky day because there was a loose trolley that I didn't need a pound for, so thank you God, thank you for a blessed day. So many people stare when you vlog. So next to this Marks and Spencers, there's a Sainsbury's and that queue, there was no queue for Marks and Spencers, wonder why, um, but the queue for Sainsbury's, you probably would have been waiting like 40 minutes. That was ridiculous. I'll show you when I go back outside. Really want to buy a Colin the Caterpillar. Does anyone else have these on their birthday? Not that I've ever celebrated birthdays before last year, but Hannah got me my first one for my birthday last year and put my face on it. If you saw the vlog, let me know in the comment section, but this is reminding me of her. <laughs> but I am trying to do a healthy shop even though I'm about to go and buy some porn star martinis. <laughs> I've got some bits for my mum as well and I'm getting some bits for my nan because obviously she can't leave the house. I just realised I've not brought my ID and I genuinely look like a 12 year old today, so great. These are ridiculous. I'm gonna get two because why not? <gasps> Five pounds. I might even get three. Oops. So this is what we're looking like so far. I'm not gonna lie, I've not kept it really healthy. I've obviously got little bits of healthy food, but I've got some little treats as well. And since everyone's making banana bread, and to be honest, I can't be bothered, I'm gonna buy some. I swear, I actually get so carried away. I've just spent 105 pounds. I mean, we've got plenty of food for the next couple of weeks, I guess, but I've also just got a couple of bits for my nan as well. Honestly, supermarket shopping isn't what it used to be, I swear. Every corner I was turning, I was jumping. Although, I feel like some people just don't get what's going on. Like, I swear, I could literally feel a woman's breath on my neck. I can't talk about it because I'll get annoyed. But anyway, I'm going to go and drop these little bits off for my nan. I got her some flowers and little things like that. She is the first person I'm going to go and see after all this is over because I miss her so much. Oh. Hello. I actually hate it when YouTubers say this. I find it so cringy, but just seeing her on her own and stuff, it's just not easy. But I'm really thinking about everyone who lives on their own and you know people that are feeling lonely i'm thinking about the elderly my nan has not left her house in weeks <sighs> so hard man i'm sorry for this section of the vlog because i usually hate it when people do this but i just i want i want to make my vlogs more relatable and i want to feel like we're all in this together because we are so yeah i don't know why i'm waffling i'm gonna go home <laughs> we're just putting all the stuff away i've not actually had anything to eat today so i probably need to eat something i might do my nails and have some watermelon and then maybe have this for lunch this is like a mushroom pap what how do you pronounce that mom she's back by the way i was saying before i've really missed you today watermelon is actually an elite fruit especially when the sun's out this is actually so good this hair I love going natural, but I mean, this isn't gonna be very aesthetically pleasing for you on vlogs. Not that I ever look aesthetically pleasing, because I definitely don't. But I just wanted to catch you guys up, so um, not that I've moved anywhere. I've finished my watermelon now. But I'm actually controlling Rachel's day today, so I think that's probably gonna be up before this video. I'll link it in the description box, but I'm controlling Rachel's day. So far, I've got her to do yoga, I've got her to have pancakes for breakfast. You know what, I'm not gonna say anymore. Just go and watch the video and see what I get her doing. I'm coming down here because it's the only place where there's okay lighting, but I find doing nails so therapeutic. I may as well have my own little salon at this point. I just think this is gonna save me so much money in the long run. I spend like 25 pounds on getting gel nails and this whole kit was like, 50 so it's probably gonna save me money in the long run. My nails are looking more acceptable now so I'm gonna make some lunch. I'm not that hungry after that watermelon because I ate the whole thing but I'm gonna make this mushroom pappardelle even though I'm not really making it I'm just putting it in the microwave. Also I need you guys to see this lemon drizzle because that is ridiculous. Hi. Why have I not been wifed off yet? I'm really confused. <laughs> I'm joking. 
feel like the only person that really enjoys being sat on the floor. I just find it really comfortable. But you're currently in my conservatory and I've got my lunch. So I've got my mushroom, pappardelle and some salad. I'm going to try this on camera because if you guys like mushrooms and pasta and things like that, then you might like this from Marks and Spencer's. I've never actually had the pasta ready meals from there. That is ridiculously good. Just finished. I never finish food. I don't know what it is. I think I've got something wired in my brain where I feel like I have to leave a little bit. There'll always be just a small amount of food left on my plate. I don't know why. It could literally be the smallest meal and I have to leave something, but I genuinely couldn't leave that. That was so good. I'm gonna do my yoga a little bit later on, so I'm just gonna go edit my playlist video. I've got a cup of tea. This is the fourth of the day. Honestly, I'm going through so much tea. I'm drinking tea like it's water. Where did this angelic hair come from, please? <laughs> it looks so good. I've not been putting any heat on my hair recently. I've not been styling it. I've not been drying it putting straighteners on it. I've literally just left it to do its thing because I'm trying to get my hair, skin and nails looking amazing. I would recommend we all do that because imagine coming out of quarantine, probably a little bit, a little bit fluffier, but with amazing hair and amazing skin. So that's why I'm trying not to wear makeup every day and I'm not gonna put as much. I'll probably put a little bit of heat on my hair if I'm filming or whatever, but I'm gonna try and not use that much heat on my hair and just kind of wash it and let it air dry i've also been using eyelash serum eyebrow serum i've been doing a really good skincare routine every day hopefully we'll do a little quarantine glow up rather than glow down i'm going to edit my playlist video and upload it for tomorrow it's not tomorrow it's thursday today's tuesday so i'll upload it for thursday just get that over and done with get my work out the way and yeah i'm so grateful for this sun <sighs> weather is just amazing hey vlog hey vlog how's your day going do i look like you yet? <gasps> oh my god the hair yeah. oh i love it <laughs> i've just had a few deliveries come in the post so i'm gonna go upstairs and show you what i got i did get one from plt but i'm thinking about doing like a quarantine styling video i don't know whether that's something that you would want to see but that's what i'm thinking of doing anyway rather than just doing another plt haul but i'm just making my fifth cup of tea this is not normal, but if you drink tea as much as me, let me know. I might even have a little piece of cake because I don't think I'm going to have a proper dinner because that pasta was so filling. If you drink tea with milk, are you A or B? Because I'm B. I don't really like a lot of milk in my tea. Are you on Instagram or? On the vlog. On the vlog? On the vlog. Is it on? Hello. Anyway, it's nice to see you all again. I can see <laughs> all 209,000 of you. How, how Woo! Also, Dad, you are the next to be pranked, so sleep with oh. one eye open. So yeah, like I was saying, I've just got a delivery from PLT, but I'm going to do that in a, in a different video. And then I also got a stock up from Look Fantastic, so thank you so much to the girls there. I got a MAC brush cleaner because I want to clean my brushes and I can't be bothered getting them wet, so if I want to do like a quick clean, I always use this. I also got a new Soft Glam palette because I ran out of all the colours that I usually use, so um, yeah, I just got a new one of them. I got my setting powder, which is the YSL Souffle de Clare. I don't know how you say that, but this one. And I use shade 2 for everyone wondering. Um, they're just bits from PLT. I got my favourite lip combo. I just got a top up because I was running out. So I got Cork Lip Liner by MAC and Yash Lipstick by MAC. And then I just got two eyebrow pencil things. I already had a piece, but I'm going to do... <laughs> I'm going to do a taste test on camera because you guys need to understand how good this cake is. I'm going to do a video making this because this, honestly, you won't have a better lemon drizzle than this. I'm sorry, but you won't. You won't. You definitely won't. I would probably say I'm the cook of the house. I'm better at cooking. My mum's better at baking. So I've been doing a lot of the cooking and she's obviously been baking every day and showing me how to bake. We made apple pie the other day. Um, we made lemon drizzle. What else have we made? Banana bread. Um, little pies, tart. We've basically baked everything in the book, but 
my mum's lemon drizzle is undefeated this is a really random thing to tell you but my mum actually made my ex-boyfriend this and he just fell in love with her he was like okay your mum's a keeper he obviously was not <laughs> all of a sudden i don't know how but it's half eight <laughs> This day has flown by probably because I woke up at 12 but it's getting dark out so I probably won't go for my walk. I'm just going to save it till tomorrow. I don't know why I'm saving it till tomorrow because I go every day but because I've already been out to Marks and Spencers I feel like I don't really need to. So I'm going to go and put a face mask on. I'm going to make a porn star martini and I'm going to do my yoga. I think I'm going to do my yoga first with my face mask on and then just chill out for the rest of the night. I've done my work so I'm happy. Sorry if this vlog's really boring. I've not really done much or given you guys much many ideas to do in quarantine which is what I wanted to do but I'll do that in the next one hopefully today's just been a little bit more casual I've not really had like a schedule or anything the only thing I wanted to do was go to Marks and Spencers and get my food which I've done so yeah I didn't really have much of a plan but I'm gonna go and make I'm gonna put a face mask on now I'll show you which one I use so I've been using this one from Mario Badescu this is the super collagen mask I've been using this one because I feel like my skin at the minute is pretty normal it's not dry or oily but the one thing that I have noticed is that I'm starting to get really fine lines I'm 23 this year oh I'm 23 this year that actually makes me want to vomit I still feel like I'm 18 but anyway I'm gonna put this on because it's got collagen in it and hopefully will prevent me from getting wrinkles because I'm turning so old this year. I'm literally wearing face masks nearly every day. Not the same one. Sometimes I'll wear like a sheet mask because I know it's not probably good for your skin to wear the same one every day. But if my skin is not glowing and amazing after quarantine, then... I mean, nothing will really happen. I'll just be a bit fuming, but still. <laughs> Face mask is on and I'm just about to do a little bit of yoga. I've put on a comfier top because that other one was just getting on my nerves. So I'm going to do a yoga class. I'll leave it in the description box which one I do. Um, but I'm going to go and charge my phone because it's flashing red. So I'll do that, come back and we can have a little drink. So his mask is hardened now, so I can't laugh, but... Mum's doing a taste test of the porn star martini. How good is that? Oh, that's delicious. Isn't it? Mm. A few porn stars in this house, hey? Mm. Also, while I'm here, I feel like I've not really spoken about this on YouTube, but I actually used to play the piano when I was younger. So I did up to grade... What grade did I do up to, Mum? I did. What grade did I do up to in piano? Four. I did up to grade four, but I'm thinking about starting it up again. So I'm learning Beauty and the Beast at the minute, and I'm learning it by sound. So I've not got any sheet music, but I'm going to order some sheet music online and reteach myself, hopefully. And then once all this quarantine, corona-ish is finished, I'm going to have less. I'm going to have lessons again. So I'll show you what I've got so far. I mean. <laughs> probably not gonna sound great also this piano is a million and one years old so it does sound a bit rusty if this isn't a mood then i don't know what it is i'm not gonna lie it's the next day obviously it's light outside but i put my camera on charge last night got in bed and then i just passed out i was so tired so i'm sorry about that but I'm going to end this vlog here. So thank you for watching. I am going to do a little bit of yoga now. I've just got this little jumpsuit on from Pretty Little Thing. And I'm going to do my yoga, have my morning coffee. And yeah, that's it for the vlog. I am going to do a lot of these. So hopefully the next one will be a little bit more entertaining. Because I didn't really do much yesterday. But in the next one, which I'm kind of nervous about, I'm going to cut my own hair. But I'm not just going to cut, like trim it. I'm actually going to cut it because I want it like nipple length whereas now it's like down here and my tapes are falling out so I just feel like my hair will be more manageable if it's shorter so I'm gonna learn how to cut my hair on YouTube and then that's gonna be the next vlog so great I am only cutting my extensions by the way not my actual hair because god forbid James my hairdresser would kill me so yeah thank you guys for watching I hope you enjoyed this vlog and yeah there's gonna be a lot more vlogs like this coming your way so 
I hope you do enjoy them. <laughs> if there's any videos you want to see with my mom or my dad or anything like that, then let me know, obviously, in the comment section. And yeah, that's it from me. I love you all so much, and I'll see you in the next vid. Bye.